Hello everyone, welcome back to another Dr. Twisted's Toy Time. Well, I went... I wasn't going to go to a thrift store today. I wanted to go to Target and check and see if they had the new DC Primal Age figures. So I went there and they didn't have anything. I mean, they did have the, the castle, but I wasn't going to spend $60 on something today because the wife and I are going out on a date date night tonight and I wanted to have money for the the show and everything so I decided to go to the pawn shop I usually go to that has a little toy bins and it wasn't open so I went to another thrift store that was down the street and that wasn't open I'm like oh man this is just a bummer of a day so I started going home and at the light by my house where I have to turn I was like okay if all the lights are green then I'll go to this one thrift store that I usually go to and because I had to drop a package off at the post office anyway I'm like if all the lights are green on the way then I'll stop at this thrift store so all the lights were green which is usually impossible so it was meant to be for reasons I will talk about later but right now I want to do the toys so let me show you what I got I got a grab bag I got this amazing frog so if you know me you know I love these anatomical model kits I have several of them so I saw this one, I didn't have a frog yet, and I opened up the box to see if it was there, and it looks like everything is there. So that was a cool little find. Also found this tin Muppet Show car. I mean, this thing is in great shape. It's got all the awesome characters. My favorite, Gonzo and Rizzo. It's animal. Kermit, Miss Piggy, and Fozzie. That was a sweet, sweet find right there. I love that. And this awesome thing. This big uh, Velociraptor from Imperial. 1998, I believe it was. Yeah, 98. The funny thing is they call it a Valala Raptor, so they misspelled it, <laughs> which I thought that was funny, but I didn't know uh, Imperial did toys like that. At first, I thought it was a definitely dinosaurs toy because of the the arms and legs are articulated. And Imperial toys usually they aren't articulated, but that was a really cool find too. And now onto the bag. I wanted to open it with you I mean this bag looks pretty pretty awesome it's got all kinds of cool little items and there was another one that was $6.99 I believe yeah six six ninety nine plus I had a 10% off coupon today so everything was 10% off so let me open this and show you what's inside because I'm excited to see what's inside as well all right this is awesome it's like a, kind of a rubbery uh, deep sea fish that thing is awesome first thing out of the bag and that's just very cool. I love that. Okay, there's uh, whatever this thing is. Looks like a, it's supposed to be. It? A little robot car deal. I don't know. Pretty cool though. Just says China. 
don't see any other markings on it. If anybody knows, let me know. It's a pretty cool little item. I always get these things in the bag. It's like the Shark Boy and Lava Girl. Lava Girl. Darth Vader figure. Pretty cool. Looks like he's got a uh, lightsaber action going on. This thing is pretty cool. I'm not sure what that is, but he's pretty big. Let's see what does it got markings on him? Oh, it's Mega Blocks. This thing is a lot bigger than most Mega Blocks figures, though. I wonder if he's like a giant. Or what series he's from. Still a very cool, very cool piece. I like that. Here's a. Uh, that's Airbender figure. The last Airbender. Looks like he's got some kind of light arrow and eyes thing going on. Very cool. That's weird. It's got tinsel on him. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I don't know what this thing is, but he is pretty awesome. Disney 2005 Hasbro not sure cool looking piece though I'm digging that the Dr. Doom not sure what that series is. Eh, it's a Burger King Burger King toy Dr. Doom And yet another lava girl. Oh my god. This is cool. This is one of those like um screamers from McDonald's, I believe it is. Pretty sure I already have this one. Like the stretch screamers. Very cool. Is this guy here? I don't see any markings on him. Oh wait, yep, yeah. it's another Mega Blocks. So he probably goes with that same series as that one big troll thing. Spyro. Oh, it's a game. Looks like pretty cool. Pretty cool. Looks like, like a Dragon Riders of Mirth or whatever that dealy do is. Oh, this is awesome. Is that one Toy Story villain? Toy Story 3 villain, I believe. That's pretty cool. 2002? Dang, it's already been that long. That's awesome. Digging that. There's a little Buzz Lightyear. Probably from the same era. Yep, 2002. Probably from the same set. Here is a Ninja Turtle. Pretty cool. Cool, Mikey. Missing his belt, but that's all right. This looks like a one of the knockoff GI Joe, maybe Lenard divers. Pretty cool. It looks like another one. This is a variant because this one has blue fins. And this one has black. 
maybe they're like a dive team. Oh, this one has a red vest and this one has an orange vest as well. Just repaints of the same figure as they like to do. There's a little missile and a knife that go to something. Not exactly sure. Looks like a fast food premium 2003 Disney McDonald's. Yep. Here's another little premium. Usually I, I find this thing, I don't know what it what it's from but this one has a little figure that goes with it neat what do they do oh it vibrates <laughs> crazy this guy is awesome it's one of the reasons I got the bag here because I got Power Rangers dinosaur transformer deal Pretty awesome. Looks like he's missing tail. Always got to be missing something. And then, last of the toys is this dragon here. This looks like a transformer. Not the Beast Warriors, but the Trans Metals. I have a few different dragons. A lot bigger than this. But this is pretty much what he looks like. They have the same kind of tail and look. Just the wings are a lot different. but That's what he reminds me of anyway. The Trans Metals Dragon. It's a cool piece though. Very cool. That was an awesome little bag seven bucks I got some really cool pieces in there but the main reason I went I think that going to the thrift store was meant to be this time was because I finally found a dresser everyone Woo! all these weeks looking I finally found one funny thing is it's the colors of my old high school that was kind of crazy, but I really like these little handle pulls. They kind of look like skulls. But it's perfect for what I need, and it made me super happy. So that was an awesome little thrift store adventure. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed my video. I definitely enjoyed my scores. Found some awesome stuff. Finally got my dresser. I will call this hunt a success. Thanks so much for watching, friends. Until next time, peace.